Okay, hello, this is x Moon. It looked an interesting puzzle game, I'm hoping I can play it on the controller, it didn't seem to work on the menu, but you know how some things are. It's like, um, sometimes the menu just doesn't work with the gamepad, but the actual game will. So it seems an interesting game, so I thought I'd check it out. Now, you might have a bug, it might have just been Steam, but when I added it, um, it didn't seem to recognise in my library and it completely... Oh, it does work on controller, let's go. It's just odd that the menu isn't controller friendly. But that's that's fine. That's nothing. You know, that that can be fixed. Ooh, that's a nice view of the earth. And it's actually pretty good texture for the earth, actually, as well. That looks pretty sweet. You know, it looks 3D. It doesn't just look like a pasted image. Okay, so I've landed on the moon! We're on the moon. We can jump. No, um, I'm not going to nick other people's memes. <laughs> There's another lander over there. Can't climb this lander, but it's a puzzly sort of game, and I thought, you know, that's right in my real house, I'd go check it out. But yeah, as I was saying, um, if it just says weird X game thing, it might be a Steam bug, because apparently they're changing the Steam library as well. So, you know, that's worth noting. But, um, yeah, just exit Steam and reload, and it will be sorted. Because, you know, I'm sure I posted on the, um, why, why are there two landers, like, right next to each other? Sure, it's po I posted on the thing because I was like, why didn't this add to my library? But then next time that I opened up Steam, it was there. So it must have just been a temporary bug. I don't know if it's to do with the game or with Steam. But if you do get that issue, just, just reload Steam and it will solve it. So, you know, problem solved. You don't need to concern with that. Um, hi. Yes, right mouse button. Absolutely. Oh, no, really? <laughs> really? <laughs> you are actually going to make me right mouse button? Spacesuit? Um, maybe I shouldn't have clicked that. Okay, ooh, we can unlock spacesuits. Um, it's weird that it's hybrid mouse, so I'm going to have to literally left click. Okay, you're finally here! Where the hell have you been? Um, where is it? A, X, triangle, circle. <laughs> um, yeah, I, I'm half PlayStation programs. I'm more PlayStation program than YB, honestly. Select up, down, left, right, L3, R3, nothing. Literally, I have to do it on the mouse. Okay. It's been feeling so spooky here all by myself. I'm Sergeant Raymond, US military. I've been assigned to serve as your bodyguards. You'll find this ancient door in the crater behind me. Oh, they didn't tell you, I guess it really is top secrets. So, about a week ago, some lunar geologists were working here trying to understand the unusual volcanic activity in this area. Anyways, they found an ancient door just underneath this moon dust. I know, crazy, right? The geologists say it's been here for billions of years. No, I haven't gone inside. It gives me the creeps. Since you're the world's top archaeologist, we thought you were the best qualified to go in there and take a look around. They tell me there's a device in there that can patrol just by thinking. I'll let you go and investigate, but don't get the solar system blown up. I'll, uh, wait here. <laughs> uh, no, I'm not afraid to go inside. You you just go ahead. I'll stay and, uh, guard the entrance. Um, yeah, it, that, that's odd that, um, I have to use the mouse for that. Like, I'm um, also hypersensitivity on the controls with the controller. Okay, so, just gonna literally click everything else. Right, that's jump. Like, Ooh, what? What? RB made it vibrate for a second. I don't know what I did, but my controller vibrates. Um, options. Let's see if I can reconfigure the controls. <laughs> okay, so place object, remove objects, jump. Um, there doesn't seem to be controller controls, so that that's um, anti fun. But, you know, maybe they can fix that again. I don't know if it's early access, but I think it's at least only just come out. So, you know, like, it's odd that I can jump on the controller, but you can't actually... I'm going to go explore a bit. I know the door's over there. I just want to go see how far the landscape goes. Hey, don't venture out too far! I'll have to cut off your oxygen to keep you from getting lost. So, <laughs> clever. I can see quite a long at the landscape, but um, I can also maybe see the edge of the landscape. Are you going to cut off my oxygen? 
Oh, are you gonna kill me to stop me? It's literally gonna be death walls, isn't it? But I'm sure people are gonna find their way outside of death walls, you know, people can jump over death walls and find them. People are persistent enough. But, you know, you can sort of see the end of the landscape. I'm not gonna break the game. <laughs> Yeah, 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 I'm coming back, I'm coming back. Although, by ignoring him, because I didn't actually click, because um, there aren't mouse controls on my controller, <laughs> um, does that not cut off my oxygen? Because it didn't seem to be, like, deteriorating my oxygen, unless I've got not hidden oxygen gauge, or, you know, it's not like instant death and I would have eventually suffocated, I don't know. Here's the door, oh, yeah, um, hi mouse controls. Click again to open the door. <laughs> yeah, I'm definitely going to have to use mouse controls, which feels strange. I guess we'll just hybrids. Okay, so, um, oh my god, actually. Wow. You can't look around with the mouse. <laughs> so, I can't truly hybrids. Like, I could have hybrided, like, old school FPS style, but, um, like, the mouse sensitivity is so low. Like, that's impossible to look around. We get the controller sensitivity is way too high. Okay, so we've got a um, solar system map. We've got, like, a 3D sort of perspective sort of thing, saying, you know, 3D space, although that one bar there seems a bit off. It doesn't seem to be coming from the central mass. So it's communication I guess because you know there's like words and scales and things on the sides of them so it's like a form of communication we've got two sun things we've got some planet systems here again you know clearly planets branching out from the sun but in the wrong way okay so this is the sun and then it's branching out that way to the bigger planets out there but then it leaves off like the Dwarf planet that wasn't a planet, or was a planet, and now isn't a planet, and now whatever. <laughs> you know, it's a planet again. Not just a dwarf planet, but it's actually a planet. So then we've got some sort of um, dystopian nightmare of a, what's it called? I, I can't think of the term right now. The, the steps that go on forever and things like that, you know, those scales. Space, well, I mean, it's A, or X if you're a playstation <laughs> to jump it's also odd that you're giving me like keyboard controls when i'm clearly playing on controller but um, yeah some of them aren't mapped so your controller controls for like left mouse button aren't mapped i can probably get up there but do i want to again you know sensitivity for looking around is probably a bit too high also i can see the sand there Maybe see off the edge of the landscapes. Okay, so we've got some more drawings. A diamond. Okay, we've got a door of some sort here. Oh, it is literally a door. This stone seems odd. Indeed it does. It's a, it needs a key, clearly, which is going to be the diamond, which I'm going to have to go find. Okay. Hello. This is an interesting room. I like the textures in it. Aha! Puzzles. It's also um like lasers and reflections and things, so you know, it looked really cool from the thing. Okay, so Okay, so X counts as left mouse button with the puzzles. So that's actually pretty good. But um can I make it go upwards? Ah, down is up. That's um woo. <laughs> du -du -du -du. I couldn't um Oh no, it's a sinister long slow fall as the items fall way faster than me. <laughs> I feel like that should have maybe been a bit faster. It's like, it's like, oh no, we fell. But, you know, it didn't seem to really have consequences. So I'm glad that at least that works, but I feel like up and down is reversed for me. <laughs> okay, I need some reflectors. Can I take that one? Do I pick them up? Okay. Mirrors. <laughs> Perfect. Okay. Ooh. What is that? That, um... Okay, I have to left-click again to retrieve items. 
Yeah, I don't like that I've um, got to do that with something. Oh, I, I can pick up mirrors, but um, I didn't want to retrieve. Okay. No way to place it. Not even on mouse. Okay. Well, I kind of want to reflect this, but... Wait. Oh, you can place it from a distance. That's strange. Okay. Perfect. We powered it up. That's odd that um, we can do that from a distance, but we can't do it like right next to it. Okay. Three of these. Sure, it won't be a problem. Okay, I should have um, checked with the controller to see if it works controller like Also, you know, when you accidentally send it the wrong way, but you have to reposition where you are to go actually connect it again, because it's not like a permanent radius place. Wait. I can! Okay, that that's good. Right. Come on, place it. Place, place it. Uh, look, sensitivity is way too high on controller, and again, you know, too low on the mouse. So like, we can slowly drag it there with the mouse if we click a million times. Right. Well, I'll set up those mirrors after. And thankfully, like these beams don't hurt us, so we can just literally walk through them. Okay. Ba 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 ba. Easy. No. No. Perfect. Oh, we do interrupt lasers as well. That's that's good to know. So we can interrupt the laser beams, and you know maybe that'll be part of the puzzle again. Check every button. No, literally, no way to do that. Not even the button that seems to be the one on the things to actually do it. It's like sure you can do it with the puzzles, but it's not recognised for. That also, you know, we've got the interlacing space here. You know, ooh, here we go. We're coming into the anomaly, which is clearly was drawn earlier. You know, with the whole thing, right? So here's another door. Are they like checkpoint doors? Oh, now, now you're just not even having any interaction with it. <laughs> okay. Hi. Welcome to Detector Endpoint NGB 6589. You found it. You should pat yourself on the back. We built this intelligent life detector 2.7 billion years ago, and you're the first one to activate it. That's really something. You can call me WZK6248. I work for the Galactic Government, Bureau of Intelligent Species Management. I'm happy to introduce your species to the Galactic Government. We're the ones that maintain galactic order in this galaxy. Pretty cool, huh? You know, it's sure been boring just waiting here for somebody to show up all this time. Just kidding, I'm not actually here. I'm broadcasting into your consciousness from the workstation in the centre of the galaxy. My thoughts are interfacing directly with your mind. That's how you're able to understand me. We set up these detectors all over. Whenever an intelligent species trips one somewhere in the galaxy, it's my job to communicate with their consciousness and perform an introduction interview. Okay, I'm filling out some paperwork for your species now. How does your species communicate? Um, 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 I guess I'm... Ah. <laughs> okay, so that lets me change. Okay. We, we, no. Any, okay, every button changes it. Great. <laughs> Consciousness. But left mouse button on the mouse. Actually activate it. So everything counts as right mouse button. Every button seems to. Um, what do you see as your species' biggest weakness? Um, Rides on oxygen? No, in fighting. I'm not going to tell you that we could die for oxygen starvation. Where do you see your species in five million years? <laughs> Working for ourselves or doing your job? Well, doing your job, I guess. Hmm. The only thing left to find is a category for your species. What should your status do? Equal members, clearly. Uh, this classification is only for the most intelligent species and you don't seem very smart. 
Are you sure you could save me some paperwork if you go with slave? I'm sure. Okay, fine. My intelligent readings of you are pretty low. And if it were up to me, I'd mark you down slave. But you clearly have 200 IQ. Anyways, our ethics board requires you give us an equal... A chance. Ah, no. So you're clearly more equal members than me now. <laughs> Anyways, our ethics board requires us to give you a chance at equal member status. We have an... We have to administer an intelligent test before enslaving an entire species. And um, dyslexia doesn't count. <laughs> um, if you give up, I'll have the galactic government send some slave ships over to collect your species. I wonder if that's like a, you know, instant ending if you choose slave. To pass the test, you need to solve 12 of the 16 trials. Sound good? You can find the trials on the wall over there. I'm sure that won't be hard. Like, 16. You, you, you only need me to pass 12? Ha. Huh? Easy. To pass test, you need to solve 12 out of the 16 trials! I'm, I'm not giving up. <laughs> okay, why why are some of them already grayed in? You're like, no, they're too easy also. <laughs> With the slow mouse. Ah, now it's like literally just mouse. I can't even use controller. Okay. Ladder climbing sounds easy enough. Like, if, if you already solved these ones for me, but I need to solve these 12. <laughs> I, I'm going to start at the beginning. Literally, it's called the beginning. Okay, this should be easy enough, right? It's like literally just reflect lasers into the things, but we need to solve them in a smart way because we've only got a limited number of things. So clearly, one would be set the both of the lasers to go through one thing here, right? So if I redirect them both there, but I want them to actually come in the back end of that way. So I'll send blue, blue. Okay, right, okay. Right, we're glitching a bit. Also, oh, it's because they're not stairs. I was going to say, also, it just seems like we can just walk up these stairs, like, you know, and the lasers will probably deactivate that, so I didn't want to. Okay. Blue. So, then I'll send this blue one over here. Okay. Look at it. Blue. Right, rotates. Now, if I put this here, I kind of want the blue to come in the back. See, I'm running out of laser beams, you see. Blue down and across. I don't have enough. Which is why I need to preserve them into one thing. Yeah. Okay. Blue down, blue across. That one, two, three. It's not helpful. Right, here's where we start thinking, and the back isn't reflective for a different one, so that's a bit awkward. Hi, we have, that's just to collect all of our things up, isn't it? Yeah, okay, so we don't need that, that's just if you want to reset. I wonder if we, we could just like, you know, glitch. We could just do it with blue, honestly. I could, like, you know, really use my intelligence. <laughs> you know. Really, just get up there like that and never need the reds, maybe. You know, it's just like solve it with blue. Okay, we can also turn these, which is what I'm also neglecting, because that's mm. literally what's wrong with this. Right, uh, can I... Can, I can just pick it back up, but I need the mouse. <laughs> I don't have that control on this. Okay, so... Let's just double check. Oh no, I do have that on that. Circle. Right, that's good. We can at least do these without ever having to pick all that up. Right, so we've got red up. Which means I've got two things to do blue, which means just come down the back and it's easy. No, don't, don't come down her back. <laughs> that's what she said. Okay. The beginning! In the beginning, we solved the first puzzle and it was good. Although... It's taking forever to do that. Oh no, shit. Well, I mean, there's literally another solution to that. Which is 
no longer need this, we put it here. <laughs> and then easy. Perfect. No problem. Success! Great success! You literally need me to press spacebar. <laughs> no controller button for that. Yeah, that, that's just um, a minor thing, you know. The Pathfinder. We need everything to be able to be done on the controller, and, you know, maybe the sensitivity could. I could probably adjust that, I don't know, but, you know, sensitivity on the controller is way too high. Sensitivity on the um, mouse is like non existent. Okay, so clearly we're going to be doing that because there's no way. No. Okay. Clearly we need to use. Oh, we've got a million reflectors. Never mind. I was going to say three of them to go to that. No, I wanted you to go the other way. But it wasn't recognised in it. Why can't it turn that way? Am I just being dumb? Also, can we accidentally fall off the planet there? Now it's turning. Okay. <laughs> right. Let's go. Let's place all of these. We could probably pick them up after, honestly, without ever needing to leave them here. Who knows? Okay, keep ro keep rotating. <laughs> there we go. Right, now it's solid. Now we need to think about this. Okay. Yeah, it just seems like a million rotations, but you know, it's fine. We don't need all of these rotator discs that we've got. Also, no, I can't just jump outside and explore. <laughs> How did they not see this big facility? Oh no, there's a big door in the moon, but then there's literally an entire facility here that <laughs> is available and they they just don't seem to care. Right, we've got way too many connectors, like a million of them. Okay. Right, let's try and minimize reflectors. I'm sure we don't need to waste them all by individually activating everything. Now we've got two. Okay, well... That's a problem. Because there's no way of doing that. But, it's a problem that can be solved because we can just go and adapt our method of play. Which is by doing this. And then we'll take these back because these are never going to be useful anymore. Stop. And there. And there. And there. And perfect. Easy. <laughs> and then red's already done. It's not even a blue. <laughs> if I could jump out and escape the map, that'd be really silly, wouldn't it? Okay, a laser maze. Are we going through a maze? Isn't this amazing? No. <laughs> no puns. What is this? Oh, it's a thing that we actually need to activate, though. Okay, so this is where reflecting to go down is a thing. Right, so we will need to set that up, I guess, in advance. Then, you know, clearly this one. Aiming is not ideal. And then this one in advance. Okay. Rotate round, okay, that's perfect. That should be up and then that should be down, so that should be fine. Okay, so. I mean, if we can save things to come straight to that, that seems smart. But then it needs to go up. Aim. AIM. AOL Instant Messenger, no. Plus. Plus, no. <laughs> we don't use AOL. Okay. Rotate to that. Then that's the end. I mean... Right. Stop. Stop. There we go. I've got loads of things left. So, you know, we will be going back down there. Eventually. So...
yeah, we do need to go down this way. Right. We're running low on beams, but I think we got it. I'm just gonna like readapt. No, that that's clearly not gonna work. Readapt this to that way. Because um you know, there we go. <laughs> Easy. Right. Then um I know we've got the stairs, but that is way too far to jump, isn't it? <laughs> they have considered these things, so that is good. Yeah, it seems pretty fun. It's just, um, you know, the, the bugs with some of the things not being mapped to the controller is a bit odd. It's a little odd. And it's a little bit funny. That it doesn't quite work. Okay, well. Let's just... No. Ah, now it's letting me not have to move again to do that. That's cool. Okay, let's redirect after that. No, plus. 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 There we go. <laughs> right, let's um try and minimise the uses of these. Because I feel, yeah, we've got a very limited supply. Okay, sometimes that's a bit awkward to aim. Right, we'll go through two here. If I can position. There we go. Then we will rotate through this one, then rotate back. It's fairly easy. Lasers 101. But obviously it's just like introducing you to it now. So, you know, that is how it works. A column! Oh, we did all the A's. How surprising. Uh, then it's the B's and the C's and the D's. What, what do you have to say to me, sir? Pass out test, yeah, 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 yeah. So I thought you'd have um something new. <laughs> I wonder if we we get to be like Galactic Overlords and take your job if we do all sixteen. But you're the first four for your twelve for your intelligence test, like you know that wasn't hard to not be slaves. <laughs> this is the true intelligence test. <laughs> Can you find cool? Ooh, we could have done that. Oh, there's a roll. That's interesting. Okay. Sorry, I, I've been up here. I, I need to just have a peek. I just need to have a peek what you've got going on up here. Hi. What are you doing out there? <laughs> what? Please stop bothering me. Communicating with your me measly consciousness is exhausted. <laughs> you did have a go at me. I wonder if there's like an achievement for really pissing them off, like, you know, non-stop con contacting the consciousness. Also, is that light ours, or is that like to do with the consciousness? But yeah, I mean, um, it's cool. I'm just going to wait for the rest for the, um, the controller issue to be sorted so that everything works on controller. But yeah, join us again for some more. Thanks for watching. Goodbye.